Hey guys, this is Mr. Crayfish, and today we're going to be doing another furniture mod update. In this video today, I'm going to be showing off something that I'm quite proud of. Um, so, the past couple of days, I've actually spent probably like nine hours working on this, just getting it to work. And uh, in the last update videos, I explained to you guys that I wanted to add, s add some sort of function to this mailbox here. Um, the original idea was that you could come up with any uh, you could come up with any item to it and just insert it in, but unfortunately that didn't work because they actually need to add some code um, to the the item or the block, and I can't do that to base classes. So what I've decided to do is create an envelope, and now what this envelope will do is you will open up a GUI as I show you right now, and you can stick your items in here. So I've just stuck a, a brown wool and a mailbox in there. And then what you do is you come up to your neighbor's mailbox, you shift, and then you right click. And what it does, it inserts it in. Now, I can't actually show you this right now because um, I actually haven't added the feature. Well, it is in, but it's quite buggy, as I can show you right now. So if I shift, right click, you'll see that it does nothing. But if I open it, it's got this weird thing in here. And if I right click it, it just disappears. Uh, so I've got to fix that up. Um, now I just want to explain a little bit about this envelope here. Now each one is unique, so if I open this one up, you'll see that we've got brown ones in there. And then this one at the end here um, doesn't have anything in it, which is really cool. Now how I actually did this, I might just explain something a little bit technical here, because I actually have nothing else to show off. Is that um, when you first create an a, uh, envelope, uh, it generates a unique ID for it and this uh, allows it so it has different inventories because what happened before is when I didn't have that um, this this mailbox inventory here would be in this one which I didn't want because that's kind of like a ender um, like an ender ender chest but in your items uh, and I didn't want that so I've applied a unique ID to it and it saves it um, using the MBT uh, program that Notch created to save um, like data and everything for Minecraft, even your Minecraft world, it's saved in that, which is really cool. Um, but yeah, that's really all that I have to uh, say in this video. Uh, I'm not sure when the next update is going to come out because I've still got a lot to work on. Um, and coding takes a while, just this envelope took a long time to do, nine hours just to figure out this saving code for it. Um, so I do appreciate if you guys do leave a like if you have any ideas for my furniture mod um, please leave a comment in below because I will look at them and I'll see you guys next time bye